Here we have our M12 short wave, long wave, ultraviolet light. The light uses four AA batteries and uses a four watt bulb enhanced to six watts. The six watt provides greater output for the lamp. The lamp features a 375 nanometer long wave LED and the enhanced four watt short wave. Also note that you want to have the glass filter. Without the glass filter you cannot clearly see the fluorescent tagging on the stamps. As an example, I will turn off the visible light and you can clearly see the tagging generated on the stamps. Most current stamps are almost, yeah, I'd say about 95% of current stamps have a phosphor tagging on them and lots of older stamps do as well. Again, most are going to need the short wave. And again, be sure to have the external filter because there are some companies that will sell you just the bulb itself. But as you can see, the bulb does not clearly define any clear tagging of the, uh, the stamps. Also, fluorescent minerals are good for or being used with the, with the light. This is under short wave. And under long wave, 90% of fluorescent minerals are going to need a short wave, but some minerals do respond under long wave as well. This is an example of a uh, mineral, fluorescent mineral from Canada. And as you can see, the long wave does not do anything for the stamps. But again, under filtered short wave, you have the stamp tagging. Great lamp, best lamp on the market for its price range. If you have any questions, you can reach us on the web at www.ultravioletools.com. That's ultraviolet dash tools with an S dot com or at 512-775-1416. Thank you.